Every four years, the presidential race lands here at the Iowa State Fair. We caught up with some of the national and international media who came to see what it's all about. I'm a photojournalist from a Swedish newspaper, and we're here to cover the politics at the IYSA fair. Is this your first time at the fair? It is my first time at the fair, and also the first time in Iowa. Okay, what are your thoughts or observations so far? Uh, it's so much things to do. It's not just politics. We were here until late last night. Uh, my thoughts, great diversity in anything. Food is great. People are great. Yeah. Oh, it's terrific. Yeah, it's my first day ever at the Iowa State Fair, and it's a lot of fun. And I can see why people say it's all about food. There's plenty of that, and it's my kind of food, so I think I'd be happy. It's a, it's a hot day, and you can tell I'm overdressed, so it's, it's not hard to spot the, uh, the first timer. For, for a lot of our readers in Europe and Australia and elsewhere, it can seem quirky and eccentric. The rest of the world watches this fascinated that Iowa and the Iowa State Fair play such a, a huge role in deciding who is going to be the most powerful person in the world, who's going to be the commander-in-chief of the, the most awesome military in the world, and you know, for a while this is the center of the political universe. Hello. Hi. Hi. Okay. I think what I want is a fried pickle dog with ham and spicy green cheese. Okay. There's nothing like this. There's nothing else that I cover that is like this. I, you know, everyone says, oh, it's the Super Bowl, it's the this, it's the that. You, it's not even worth comparing because the Iowa State Fair, I don't know anything with the history of this state fair and the importance to the country in the politics of this state fair. Oh my God. It's really good. And also just the sheer diversity of fun, delicious, and actually wacky stuff that happens in this fair, so it's special. It is a lot like covering Congress in that you are constantly running around, you are much better off with comfortable shoes, uh, you have to be ready for things to change immediately, and people who seem nice might not always be nice, but the reverse is true, that people who might seem mean generally are very nice. So in that way it's like Congress, but otherwise, it's a lot more laid back and fun. I do think it's uh, important, it's good, that uh, the American presidency, at least partly, depends on this kind of retail politics, uh, the one-on-one -on -one interactions, and candidates being able to hold a conversation and look voters in the eye and, and, <clears throat> and talk about that. It's not something too sort of lofty and, and set in marble, and that's, that's part of the power of uh, Iowa. Many Iowans take politics extremely seriously and are very knowledgeable. They know the drill in a way that uh, your average citizen almost anywhere else in, in America doesn't. Uh, so, so yeah, it's, uh, it's certainly fun to be here and to cover it.